Hi students, this animation and description would help you to learn physics even more easier and better. So please do watch it and enjoy learning physics. Self-induction The property of a coil which enables to produce an opposing induced EMF in it when the current in the coil changes is called self-induction. A coil is connected in series with a battery and a key K. On pressing the key, the current through the coil increases to a maximum value and correspondingly, the magnetic flux linked with the coil also increases. An induced current flows through the coil, which according to Lenz's law, opposes the further growth of current in the coil. On releasing the key, the current through the coil decreases to a zero value and the magnetic flux linked with the coil also decreases. According to Lenz's law, the induced current will oppose the decay of current in the coil. Coefficient of self-induction when a current I flows through a coil, the magnetic flux phi linked with the coil is proportional to the current. Phi directly proportional to I or phi is equal to L I. Where L is a constant of proportionality and is called coefficient of self-induction or self-inductance. If I is equal to 1A, Phi is equal to L into 1, then L is equal to Phi. Therefore, coefficient of self-induction of a coil is numerically equal to the magnetic flux linked with the coil when unit current flows through it. According to the laws of electromagnetic induction, the following equations are right. The coefficient of self-induction of a coil is numerically equal to the opposing EMF induced in the coil when the rate of change of current through the coil is unity. The unit of self-inductance is Henry. One Henry is defined as the self-inductance of a coil in which a change in the current of 1 ampere per second produces an opposing EMF of 1 volt. Self inductance of a long solenoid. Let us consider a solenoid of n turns with length L and area of cross section A. It carries a current I. If B is the magnetic field at any point inside the solenoid, then Magnetic flux per turn is equal to B into area of each turn. But B is equal to mu naught N I by L. Magnetic flux per turn is equal to mu naught N I A by L. Hence, the total magnetic flux pi linked with the solenoid is given by the product of flux through each turn and the total number of turns are given as follows. Pi is equal to mu naught n i a by L into N. That is, pi is equal to mu naught n square i a by L. If L is the coefficient of self-induction of solenoid, then pi is equal to L i. From equations 1 and 2, L i is equal to mu naught n square i a by L. Therefore, L is equal to mu naught n square a by L. If the core is filled with the magnetic material of permeability mu, then L is equal to mu n square a by L. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe this channel for more videos.